what is up everybody it is december 4th 2022 in we're in the irwin lake area but this is the greater big bear valley we are getting some light drizzle and the clouds look scary scary look at those over there coming in coming in by the mountain right there just nasty looking but it's uh 44 degrees kind of a bummer i was hoping if we did get anything today it would be a little light snowfall but that's not happening but wow look at how gorgeous this is wow so Irwin lake you guys we are on the opposite side of town off of highway 38 so to get to big bear lake we'll we're going to be driving through big bear city to get to big bear lake and that's what we're going to do right now so we're we're on a, a road called State Lane, which is which takes you to a neighborhood called Irwin Lake. Very quiet out here. Very quiet out here. It's great. Um, but yeah, we're coming up to Highway 38 right now with a little drizzle in the hizzle. So we're gonna hang a Roscoe. If we make a left here, then you'll start heading out of Big Bear. But we're not going that way. We are entering Big Bear. All right, guys. So beautiful, blue skies, just crisp blue skies with drizzle in the background. It's, it's just, it's, it's wonderful. What, what a beautiful place, you guys. Hello, everybody. Hope y'all doing great. Thank you guys for all the love and support constantly. Can never thank you guys enough. You guys make me feel so good and you guys have actually saved my life and you, yeah you guys have actually saved my life sorry that the camera did that went really bright I just had to stop it and start over again but that's okay just unbelievably blessed that to have you guys in my life what a m bunch of amazing people you are oh it's so gorgeous it is just so gorgeous, you guys. Just like your guys' hearts. So, yeah, unfortunately, when it comes to our snowfall, you guys, I I don't know what's what's really going on. We've we've had opportunities like uh, to have a lot of snow recently and these storms keep on missing us. It's, it's such a bummer because I want you guys to be able to come up here, especially this time of year, to enjoy the holiday seasons and spend time with your families and just just have the love flowing. And for me, it's always been a lot better when there's snow. Like I just, it's just, it's such a magical feeling when there's snow outside and you're on vacation with your families and moms and dads and kids and, oh, it's, it's just, it's just quite a bummer that we're not getting any of that right now. However, every December that I've lived here, this will be the eighth, this is the eighth December. I haven't experienced much in the way of uh, um, a lot of snow in December. January has been the snowiest month since I've lived here. By far, since I've lived here. But December, of course, we can get a lot of snow. It's just... Uh, so far it's not looking like we got much on the radar to help us out but yeah anyway that turn we just made we're on big bear boulevard now you guys and we are in big bear city this is more of like a, a part of big bear valley where there's not as much tourism uh not as many restaurants i think there's still quite a few airbnbs out here but that's about it otherwise it's just a lot of locals um, Big Bear Lake area is where we have all, all the resorts and the great restaurants and stuff like that. One of my favorite shops, we're coming up here to it on the right hand side, it's called Big Bear Smoke and Vape. I'm telling you guys, the owner Sahil is such a good man, like such a good man and, and he helps us locals so much and takes care of us and they don't just have smoke stuff, they've, they've got They've, they, they've got trinkets and stuff like that. Just, they have a lot, a little bit of, of everything. And so you should stop in there and check them out. If you mentioned that I sent you, there's a chance we'll give you a discount. 
I'm not promising you anything, but there's there's a good chance he'll, he'll, he'll hook you all up. As I said, he's a wonderful man um, and just cares a lot about his city. And it means a lot to me because I care a lot about my new adopted town as well. Whatever I can do to make your guys' stay that much better, I'll go so far out of my way for you guys. Like, Because technically, it's not going out of my way, I don't feel like. I love you guys. It's so easy to do as much as I can to make you have a better time up here. Or to at least give you the opportunity to have a better time up here. So. Yeah. We're crossing a street called Greenway right now. That is one of the ways that you can get from North Shore, the other side of the lake, to this side. I think there's about three or four of those routes. There's Greenway, there's Paradise, there's Division, and Stanfield Cutoff. Those would be the four. And we just passed Big Bear Smoke and Vape on the right-hand side. Forgot to, to point it out because I'm rambling on and on like usual. But yeah, guys. If you turn right here, this is the airport off of Big Tree. So we got the airport right there. And yeah, just uh, just a beautiful day, 45 degrees, a little light drizzle. As I said, a little light drizzle in the his. The clouds do look very ominous, but there's not much precipitation involved in these clouds, unfortunately. Of course, as you guys know, I want as much snow as possible, but any precipitation, we're, we desperately need it, so. Um, I'll, I'll take anything, anything that'll help impact the lake and help make this town look more green and more beautiful. Bring it on Mother Nature. a stoplight called Division. Basically when you cross Division Road, that's when you, you, you switch from, uh, or you leave Big Bear City and enter Big Bear Lake. And that is what we are about to do right now. Right now. Once again, I hope you all are having a great day, a great Sunday, a wonderful weekend. Um, anytime I get to hit the record button and make videos for you guys, it makes my day so so great you guys are so amazing i'm so grateful for each and every single one of you okay also when you cross division road just on the left hand side it's right next door to the motel six you guys there's a great pay for sledding area so you can you can pay and they've got electric walkways that pull you up so you don't have to keep on hiking back up the hill after you're done sledding every time. So let's let's get a nice view of this place. It doesn't look too packed right now. Last night, late night, it was super packed. But yeah, look at that. Look at that, you guys. It's called Big Bear Snow Play. And they've got like a little ropes course type thing. It's just a lot of fun for the family, you guys. In my last video I made, there, there are spots where you can go find some free sledding areas. Just so you guys can experience this town a little bit more, you know, just, just drive around. And if you see spots that don't have any, like no trespassing signs, by all means, go have some fun. Go have some fun. Here is one of our little walking paths that goes along this uh, prairie area. It's amazing what we spend money on up here for the roundabouts and spending a bunch of money to completely redo this bridge right here. Um, I, I see other areas we could use the money in this town, but hey, whatever they wanna do, they do. Anyway, this is a beautiful view right here, guys. Oh man, what a gorgeous place. 
What an absolutely gorgeous place. Temperature is 46 degrees now. So yeah, we're basically gonna shut this off once we get into uh, to Moonridge. But I just wanted you guys to see that we are getting a little drizzle. And when we come around this next corner, it's one of my favorite views in all of town when you can see Snow Summit very well. Once we start making this left up here, it's, it's just so beautiful. Boom, look at that. Just gorgeous, guys. Oh my gosh, it's spectacular. So yeah, I don't see any snow coming at all, guys. Uh, it looks like this, this little bit of drizzle is gonna be ending in a couple hours. It's gonna be on and off for the next few hours, but after that, it looks like uh, we're not gonna get, get anything when our temperatures cool down tonight. So that's kind of a bummer, but it is what it is. Here's Stater Brothers to the left. And to the right, we got Vaughn's and this shopping center. You've got a DIY here and all that good stuff. You've got two Starbucks coffees in this shopping center on the right. You've got one that stands alone right here on the right-hand side, and then you've got a Starbucks inside Vaughn's. But yeah, Petco, US Bank, T-Mobile. Oh yeah. Anyway, you all, always a pleasure to deal with you guys. Um, as I said, you guys have had a huge impact on my life to a point where you guys have saved my life. When I was going through my most severe depression ever, you guys literally, just by being loving to me, saved my life. And it's, there's no hyperbole being used there, you guys. You guys have had such an impact and I just, I can't thank you enough. Thank you for all the love and support. Um, I will never let any of you down. I'm obsessive compulsive about this channel and about the things that I do on this channel. I promise you guys, I'll never let any of you guys down. Tonight, I'm hoping to take my wife to this restaurant right here called Captain's Anchorage. It's such a wonderful restaurant. They have such great prime rib. And if you want to get a nice steak, you can get a nice steak there as well. But they're known for their prime rib. Right here, Captain's Anchorage, y'all. Nothing else, as far as I'm concerned, really worthwhile. Um, there's Peppercorn Grill. That's another nice restaurant but because my standards are so high from living down the mountain there's just not much up here for like wonderful good good food as far as I'm concerned but anyway I love you all it is December 4th 2022 I just wanted to give you guys a little sample of what's going on up here because it is different weather and that's what I do love you guys talk to you later peace out stay safe and if you have any questions don't hesitate to hit me up